I'm going to show you how to make the pricing of your products a little bit more attractive for people around the world. It's a bit like parity pricing, but we're going to do it for free using WooCommerce and another free plugin. Let me show you one of our products. How to start a web design business is priced at £185 globally around the world. And I appreciate that in some countries, people might find that's a lot of money. And believe me, I do appreciate and fully understand that a lot better now. Now, if I scroll down, you're going to notice we have a regular price price of 185. Then over here, I have price for Africa, 26. I then have a price for Asia, 43. A price for Europe of 148. A price for North America of 185. Oceania, 185. And then we get down to South America, 46. How did I enable these? And by the way, these are not variations, okay? This is not like a variable box that you go and pick. This is something that I have enabled whereby when you come over to the website, geolocation is going to work out where you are and then it will show you the relevant price. I know, I know some people might use VPN to cheat the system or anything like that, but I trust and I think you're all going to be good, honest people. So how did we do this? Well, what we had to do was go and install a free plugin. It's this one here. Price based on country for WooCommerce. It's free. It's got about 20,000 active installations. It's got five stars at the moment out of 237 reviews. I don't know the developers, but this works for me. Here's what's so cool about this. Once you install it, you then just go through and then create your locations. And I'll talk you through that and it then enables it on your shop. Another thing you do have to do after installing it is go back over to your WooCommerce settings, which is down here settings, go over to the integration tab, and you do have to enter in a MaxMind license key. This is to enable the geolocation where it detects your IP address and it will then assign the relevant price to you. Now to get the MaxMind uh, license key, there will be a link in the video description. Create a free account. Once you've created that, you go to manage license keys, generate new license key, give it a name, it will give you the key, go back over here, paste it in. Now, when you paste it, it will take about five minutes. So you paste it, you hit save changes, and it says, sorry, I don't know what this is. Add it in, hit save changes, wait five minutes if it get if you get a, like an error message, what is this? And then try again five minutes later. There is a bit of a delay, but it is literally, it's less than five minutes if I'm honest. Right, so you got the plugin, you got your MaxMind uh, geolocation license key put in there. Then you go over to the tab at the end called pricing zone. So this is added in by the plugin that I've already shown you. And what you then do is go and create your location. So I've decided to base it on continents. I wasn't going to go by a country by a country. Otherwise, if you can imagine over here, I would have had one per country. I found it easier just to go by uh, continents instead. And here's how simple and easy it was. Let's go and create a brand new one. Hit add pricing zone. Make sure it's enabled. I'm just going to call it Europe 2 because I actually am going to get rid of it. Go for Venezuela as well. I'm just doing this by fake. I know these are not in Europe. Please don't start firing emails and messages over at me. But what you do is you go and put your countries in. Now, there's many places you can go to get a list of countries by continent. Once you've done that, that's literally it. You just hit save changes. There are other options available to you as well, whereby you can automatically apply automated currency rate, but you got to go get the pro version for that. But I'm using just a free version of the plugin. I also set my currency to be pounds, mainly because if you start to go, well, are you going to apply like a like say Indian rupees or something? Is that going to work for other countries in Asia as well? Probably not. So I just set it in pounds. When you pay your payment gateway, whatever, whenever you pay PayPal Stripe will do the conversion for you. But I wanted to keep it consistent. I could have gone for US dollars as well. But the basis is that you go and create your zones, you put in your countries and you hit save changes. So you can see here the countries that I've got in here. And I like to think I've covered off all of them. If there are any missing, um, someone will hopefully let me know and I'll make sure it's got covered in here. But that's all it is. Once you've done that and you've saved the changes, now, when you go into any one of your products, you're actually going to see something like this. You'll have the option for price for Europe. And what it currently says is calculate by the exchange rate. Well, we haven't gone for the pro version. So this you don't want to stick at this. You go and hit set prices manually and you go and put your regular price in. You can, if you want, put a sell price in as well. You can, if you want, go and set specific dates. But I'm keeping it really, really simple. Basically, that's it. And now whenever you go to the product page, 
If you were based in India, it's going to pull back, what was it, £26? No, £43, sorry. If you were based in Zimbabwe, it would come out with £26. And I have kind of asked a few, quite a lot of people actually, just to test it out. And it works really, really well. It's a free plugin, price based on country for WooCommerce. So I've got parity pricing to make the products more accessible to people around the world with free tools. Hey, I'm Imran Web Squadron. I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow. And maybe go and have a look at our mastery modules now. See you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that fact. Taking big swings, bitch, hand me the pack.